What's good, everybody, and welcome back to The Producer's Life. I'm your man, Big Boy Trax, and I want to thank y'all for coming back in and checking with me with another beat making video. Today, I'm in more of a chill, kind of laid back type of mood, so that's the type of beat I'm going to go for. This beat will mainly heavily rely on an atmospheric type of pad. That's basically going to be the building ground for this track. So y'all sit back, relax, and I really hope y'all enjoy this beat making video. Let's go. Alright y'all, so next we're going to throw in a bass line. It's going to be a sub type of bass that we're going to use for this track. We're going to keep it real simple, nothing too crazy, just um, just something real smooth to go with the beat. So uh, let's do this real quick. All right, so I found a pretty cool little type of lead. Now it's not like a square lead or nothing like that. It's kind of a kind of a paddish mixed in. I'm gonna just show y'all real quick. It's, it's it's kind of a heavy type of lead, but uh, let's go ahead and record this in there real fast. And I'm thinking I'm gonna add in a whole nother lead also. We're gonna do some modulation bends too. Now I'm gonna turn that down some because I don't want that too heavy since I'm gonna probably add in a whole nother lead too with it. But um all right, let me go ahead and render that down real fast. I definitely got to add in like some type of vocal type of effect, man. Like, I feel like this track needs some, you know what I mean? Like, since this is like a summertime kind of laid back track, I definitely feel like I need some type of, type of vocal stab, you know what I mean? All right, so let's go ahead and find another dope lead. Um, I'm just go ahead and just scramble through some of these. And once I got some, we're going to be right back at it. I'm just kind of freestyling this, man. I, I'm just trying to go with the flow, man. All right, y'all, so for the next instrument, I'm basically gonna be using um, arcade output. I'm gonna be using a guitar, and I think it's like the newest little batch of sounds they just uploaded. It had to be in today, it's called Memento. I think I said that right. That vibe, man, you know what I'm saying? That relaxing, kind of chill vibe. So, and I just wanna let y'all know, there's nothing wrong with using loops in arcade. Don't let nobody tell you different. I mean, you can flip it so many different ways. You can actually chop the sounds up in arcade also, but for this, I'm gonna just be using this loop straight because this loop is like just, this guitar loop is fire, so let's go. So what I'm gonna do is actually, man, because I feel like the other sound is kind of overbearing it. So let me go ahead and mute that. I think it's gonna sound better. That sounds dope. I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep that other sound because 
as y'all saw it, it was like just clashing with the guitar. Like it just didn't fit, you know what I mean? So I may or may not keep it, but for now I'm gonna just keep it on mute. And um, I think the other type of sound I wanna add is in maybe a string, um, if it's not too much. Cause sometimes you don't know until you just keep going and going, but you never wanna add too many layers to a beat because it gets overcrowded and it just doesn't sound as good. As y'all just saw, certain sounds clash and um, that sound definitely clashed. So let's go ahead and try to string out and see if that goes with it. That lead that I had in earlier, man, I'm gonna just go ahead and delete that because I don't feel like it complimented, you know what I'm saying? Like it just didn't fit in with it. So as you saw, I just deleted it, man. Um, let me go ahead and actually render down this guitar and then we're gonna find like a vocal, like a vocal chop um, to throw in there. I don't want like a full hook or nothing like that. I'm, I'm not, I don't think, but um, I might have the vocal kind of like filtered on some, you know, trap soul type. Uh, I'm not sure yet, but. All right, so let's go ahead and get that render down, y'all. And then I already got like a basic hi-hat little pattern and um clap so we need to go ahead and add in that kick drum and i mean i don't think it's any more sounds besides that that needs to be added in there Alright y'all, so the beat is basically done. So you already know what we doing. Next, we're about to go ahead and arrange this real fast. I wanted the intro like bare, so that's why you hear that. Then it's about to just drop. That's it, y'all. All right, y'all, so that wraps up the beat making video today, man. I hope y'all enjoyed it. I was just in a chill mood today, you know what I'm saying? So that's why I kind of went for that. And that's a good thing to do sometimes. Whatever mood you in, get in the studio, man, and express how you feel. And today I was just kind of just in a laid back vibe. Hopefully y'all enjoyed this also as much as I did. So if you got any other ideas of beats y'all want to see me make, always let me know down in the description. It always helps to have different ideas for different videos. And I stay checking and stay reading comments, even though sometimes it takes me a while to you know, read them and, and respond to them. But I want to thank everybody for kicking with your man Big Boy Tracks right here at the Producers Life, and I'll see y'all next time. Peace.